Okay, I'm going to continue because uh, my phone died and it cut off. So um, I left off where I was just showing you the outside of the box and I'm going to show you the inside. And again, this is a luggage that I made with a, using a template from um, Cynthia Luhu and this luggage was made out of uh, chipboard. So anyway, okay, so this is uh, where it opens and... It's got, I put this little closure right here. Well, this Velcro. Um, and so, you know, so the flower could just stay there like that. So, Rena, uh, if you're watching, to open, you know, you lift this up. And then right here, I added some Velcro. Let me open it. Um, see, there is the Velcro right there. And then I added some at the top, which I'll show you in a minute. So this is the inside of the box. And let me just um, raise the camera so you can see. And um, I think it looks like a real luggage. <laughs> it's a Chevy cheek one. So this is the inside. See how I just um, covered it with fabric. And then I used some of my uh, lace trim and just some of my um, ruffle trim right there. See? And you can even, um, <laughs> I thought that was cute, like the real luggage. You know how you can um, start things on the side. So that is, and then on that uh, front side also. So that is the bottom of the luggage, the inside bottom. Okay, and then let me show you the top. And oh, and then right here also, you can you know you can store stuff right there. See, so uh, and here is the top, and this is just part of the flower that you know latches on to the front. So oh, I just stuck my info right there, but that's not part of it. Obviously, you can take the little paper out, Rena. Um, so this is the front. Again, I covered it with um, the white satin fabric first, and then I added these um, really pretty, uh, right here, pretty appliques that I got from Craftinita on Facebook, and I think she also has a YouTube. I'll post the link below, and uh, just covered it. Um, with you know some other florette pink flowers and then I added a flat back um, pearl in the middle added these tiny broses uh, right there and um, again added some of my uh, trim right here and then I made this uh, cute banner with um, it's a canvas that uh, campus banner that I got at Michael's, uh, also in the dollar fifty or two dollar uh, bin. So I just added a little bit of uh, lace trim at the top, and that's it. And then I added, I had these um, letters that I got at Joanne's, and I spelled out Rena's name at the very bottom. I got some of this uh, pretty bling that I got at. Artie's um, Facebook also, and I will also post the link below. So this is just kind of hanging loose. I didn't attach them to the fabric. Well, here I made that um, pretty flower with lace in the back, and then I made that white one, and then just added the that uh, pink applique with the pearl in the middle, and that is it. So. That is the, the inside uh, front of my luggage. And I thought it came out really pretty. So, um, again, what can I say? <laughs> the one that made it. So, I guess I'll have to wait for, see what y'all think. Um, so, anyway, this is my luggage that I will be sending off to Rena. And, again, to close it, you just... Um, you know, push the velcro down, velcro down, and then uh, you attach it from right here. 
paint from right there. <laughs> I didn't show you. It's off frame. Um, and that's it. See? So there is my um, cute, chubby cheek luggage that I made for your arena. So, um, and then, you know, made this handle. Just hold it from there. Isn't that pretty? <laughs> and like I said, this is an 8x11, so you can store some, you know, some stuff in here. Um, and uh, use it to decorate your, your craft room. So, that is all. And I think I showed you this, this bottom part. So that is uh, my third project, everyone. I hope um, y'all are having a good day and um, hope that you can get crafty in your, in your room or your uh, craft space, whatever you have. So um, I will talk to you very soon. I will be out on vacation, so I will probably make my video of Rena's um, swap of her projects to me when I come back in about a week and a half or so. So I hope everybody is having a good um, good time, a good day, and I will talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.